Pope Francis's synodal sister is now incorporating the alphabet soup crowd into the synod on synodality. Church Militant's William Mahoney looks at the French nun's recent address to a dissident pro-sodomy group. We have to, to decide new things, to find new ways to be church. In her effort to find a new way to be church, Sister Nathalie Becar spoke on Sunday to New Ways Ministry. The heterodox group was founded in 1977 by another unconventional nun, Sister Janine Gramic, in an attempt to change the church's immutable doctrine on homosexuality. And I also speak on behalf of the majority of U.S. Catholics who favor legal marriage for same-gender couples. Sister Bicot's address to New Ways Ministry was titled Synodality, a Path of Reconciliation. For several years now, the habitless sister has been peddling the Vatican's latest buzzword. Synodality, 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 synodality. Many of Bicot's new ways to be church are difficult to reconcile with Catholic teaching. The vision of the synodal church is a kind of framework to figure out how to get rid of a clerical church. But though Bicot's ideas seem muddled, American bishops have been clear on where New Way's ministry stands. For example, in 2010, the U.S. Bishops' Conference published the following clarification. No one should be misled by the claim that New Way's ministry provides an authentic interpretation of Catholic teaching. New Way's ministry has no approval of recognition from the Catholic Church. They cannot speak on behalf of the Catholic faithful in the United States. How are we uh, living our journey together? Sister Bacart's new ways to be church seem like repackaged old ways to abandon the bark of Peter. William Mahoney, Church Militant Evening News, Detroit. Bacart belongs to the Congregation of Xavier, an Ignatian group, no, no surprise there, recognized by the church in 1963 during the Second Vatican Council.